Hello, everyone. Welcome to our low temperature thermochronology online lectures. Today, we'll be continuing learning Chapter 4 Uranium Thorium Helium Thermochronology Analytical Techniques. I'm Nital from the School of Earth Science and Resources, Chang'an University. This is my homepage QR code, and you are welcome to scan this QR code to find more about our lectures. This is the outline of Chapter 4. Last time, we have been studying with Dr. Xu Lili on the crystal characterization, and today we will be studying the third section, crystal measurement and packing. Once a few tons of crystals are characterized and selected, a photo is taken of each grain and always remember to record magnification. Mere physical dimensions of the grains for calculating the FT factor. If the FT correction factor is larger than around 0 0.65, the grain can go to the next level. Otherwise, if the FT correction factor is too small, we will have to reject the grain. Laser heating crystals encapsulated in tubes of thermally conductive refractory metal. Appetite are put in performed plantium tubes, then crypt closed. Zircons as appetite, and most labs used niobium tubes or foil packets. Be careful that appetite and zircon crystals are so tiny and are very easy to lose while being measured or packed as is showing in a photo in the bottom. The capsules used for packing must be degassed prior to loading. This is because, for instance, the plantain tubes contain traces of uranium and thorium, which are subjected to be leached during the crystal dissolution step. Liable uranium and thorium is removed by leaching in about 50% hydronitrate acid for about 48 hours. Helium, uranium, and thorium must be analyzed on the same sample. Most helium applications require only one single crystal. So it is convincible that some applications such as dating of very young or low uranium and thorium samples may be better suited for multi-crystal allocates. Ideally, at least three single crystal replicates are dated to check the reproducibility of single green edges. And when needed, crystal with low uranium or thorium contents but of similar FT correction values can go together into one single capsule. This is the end of the crystal measurement and the packing section. Thank you for your attention.